All right, technically it's already spring. It doesn't really feel <laughs> it like it is yet, but the cherry blossoms are about mm -hmm. to bloom. And what a better way to welcome in the season than with some cherry blossom cocktails. Here to share a couple of recipes is master mixologist Natasha Velez Walker. Natasha, thanks so much for Hi, being with thank us. Thank you for having me. Okay, I know that not everybody can be as well versed in cocktail right. land as Amy. So, um, <laughs> just kidding. But tell us, um, for the novice, what is sake? So sake is going to be a brewed um, spirit um, that you're going to be using a few very natural ingredients. You're going to be using koji, water, rice, and it's essentially depending on the way that you um, mill away at the rice is the type of sake that you're going to have. So today we're doing a June mai, so oh. it's going to be polished up to 70%. Ooh, oh, that so, sounds fancy. Uh, okay. What you do by polishing is that you're removing some of the impurities and the fat, and you're trying to get to the center grain where you get the best flavors. Interesting. Okay. okay. All right. Yes. So you're, making, that's the, you're making two, right? I'm making two. So <laughs> we're going to, it's going to be asking. ambitious today, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. Um, All right. We're going to be doing a variation on a Negroni with um, cherry blossom vermouth, Luxardo bitter bianco, and we're we're going to use Taiku Jun Mai Saki. And then we're going to make kind of a cherry blossom sour with Ichiko Shoshu. Today we have our limited edition cherry blossom label, which is Hana. It means flower in Japanese. Okay. Oh, pretty. And we're going to be using, uh, instead of egg white, I'm using egg white substitute. This is a vegan alternative. Oh, I like that. And it's made with quale, which usually is um, very much popular for having mind enhancing, focus enhancing really? uh, abilities. Really so we're drinking for our health. What we're drinking to get smarter. So I'm gonna get started okay, over I'll here. I'll do better at Wordle. And I love I love your barware. You always have such pretty stuff. So and I have not gotten into war, uh, Wordle yet. <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, I, know. Actually, I, and I enjoy it. I do not have time for this. Some days it can be frustrating, but yeah. now do you enjoy you enjoy making cocktails with sake? Yes. Is it, okay. But people don't do it enough, right? Well, I feel like since the pandemic, a lot of people have, <laughs> yeah, right? Um, a lot of people have started experimenting at home for kind of like what they were going to do mm -hmm. and, di and differently, especially in cocktails. So I'm putting a little bit of that in here. She's getting a smarter one cocktail yes. at a time. <laughs> It'll help us with our mental abilities. Yeah, it's Monday. It's about focusing, right? <laughs> yeah. And you have the coolest ice cubes. So I made cherry blossom ice cubes at home. It's melting now, but... Um, this was easy. I just put the, I just steeped the cherry blossoms and then I added them into one of these little clear ice containers I got off Amazon. Mm, yeah. Okay. Now you explain what the sake is. Is this a different, different than sake? What yes. You have so here? this is uh, shoshu. Okay. Um, shoshu is different to sake because it's distilled, right? Okay. So I'm gonna shake this without ice quickly. All right. No ice. Why no ice with this one? Because you want the foam to ah, come. Ah. Gotcha. Alive. And, and she's got the gonna... pretty ice cubes to use, too, mm -hmm. so. Yes. Beautiful. Oh, also fancy. Do I need to be stirring this? Can, how can I help you? Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> let's let's she a master. Need my help, she, yeah, she got the title master for a reason. <laughs> a little more shaking now with the ice. Are these Japanese spirits seem to be getting more and more popular in the U.S.? Yes, and... It's growing in popularity, I think, just because, you know, the broad growth of cuisine and curiosity. Mm -hmm. But what the difference is with shochu, so with, with sake, you're using um, rice. And with shochu, you can use a variety of things. Today, we're using Ichiko, which is churro barley shochu. Yeah. And Ooh, that's, that's so beautiful. So pretty. Dun, dun, it's dun. I love it. It's and I'm going to express a little bit of lemon just for... Aww. Ooh. Okay. All right, this one's me. Yes, you I'm, the I'm handing it right over to you, and my dear. And even the pink sugar, right, is it sugar or salt? I forgot. Um, it's yuzu cherry blossom salt. Look at Ooh. that. Natasha has all the cool things. And, oh, look Ooh. at that. Ooh, oh, that I need to look good. at this ice cube. It has cherry yes, blossoms cherry in it. Blossoms That's what I was saying. I know, but I just, people can <laughs> so see it now. Okay. Yeah, so you get them as tea dehydrated, mm. and you can use them. Oh. I love the foam on here, too. Yeah, that's so kind this of a cool, is that's cool. Mm. Instead of egg white, it, and what you use egg white for, and these are alternatives for, mm. is to fortify the flavors within the cocktail. So that's why I kind of wanted to have that in there to fortify all those flavors together. I mean, you didn't need to get any smarter, but I feel smarter already. I am so smart. <laughs> Thank you so much. This is Thank awesome. You.